everyone watching. We all know what air is. It is the Earth's atmosphere. Air is made of dust particles and various gases such as nitrogen, hydrogen, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. All living organisms on Earth need air to breathe. Without breathing, all life would die. Air is all around us in the water and in our bodies. But have you ever wondered, does air take up space? It's because we can feel the breeze all around us. It feels good, but we can't see it, can we? To find out, does air take space? Let's find out with a simple experiment you too can do at home. You can do this indoors or outdoors. It doesn't really matter at all. For this simple experiment, you need a bowl filled with water, a plastic cup, and paper towels. The first step is to put some paper towels into the cup. Make sure it's snug in there so it does not fall off. And when it's secure, we can proceed to the next step. The next step is submerging the cup into the water. You have to do this with the cup straight, not tilting. We will do this now, slowly. Now we can remove it from the water. As you can see, the paper towels are completely dry. Nothing happened to them. See? Have you ever wondered why? Let me give you the explanation. It's because after we insert this into the cup and we submerge it into the water, air the air inside the cup doesn't really move out. So the water could not enter the cup and make the tissue wet. If you had done this experiment with holes on the bottom of the cup, it would have gotten wet because air would have escaped the cup and water entered and took the air space. In conclusion, now we all know that air does take up space. Thank you for listening today and I hope you learned something interesting to share with everyone you know. Thank you.